With the start of the Jewish New Year, Rosh Hashanah, just minutes away, Rabbi Darren Levine says it's the perfect time to start a new chapter by installing their new Torah scroll. The ideas of hope and optimism and new beginnings are flush within everybody's mind and heart. And while every Torah scroll holds Jewish scripture, this one holds special meaning for Levine and his congregation at Tamid, the downtown synagogue, in part because it is the very first time St. Paul's Chapel will have a new Torah scroll installed, but also because of the scribe who put ink to parchment. This is the first Torah scroll written by a female for a congregation in Manhattan. Truly represented for us our values, egalitarianism, the equality of men and women. I asked so far at Stom, Julie Seltzer, what the accomplishment means. When I step away, I, I see how amazing it is. But when she's writing those 300,000 Hebrew words using a turkey feather. I'm not thinking about you know the, the implications or that it's the first Torah written for a congregation in Manhattan. I feel the most connected and the most proud at the significance of connecting people to Torah. She did that with more than just words. More than 90% of the congregation held her hand to write letters in the Torah. Those are some of the most magical moments because I got to see and feel the experience through their eyes. The experience brought tears to most people's eyes. Tomorrow, the installation of the completed Torah scroll might draw tears again, even a standing ovation. From St. Paul's Chapel in Lower Manhattan, Vanessa Murdoch, CBS 2 News. Seltzer tell us that it took two and a half years to write, and she is one of maybe a dozen female scribes who write Torah.